Welcome back to Calypso Moon. Welcome in if you're new. Cancer, we're doing your reading. If you have your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or any major placement in Cancer, this could resonate for you. It is a general message for February 2022. I'm going to start off Cancer with your Celtic Cross overall energies. I will do a brief love spread, your side versus your person's side. And I will close the reading off with a short career in finances check-in. That's what we're going to call it, check-in. All right, Cancers, let's see what Spirit has for you. Spirit, guides, benevolent ancestors, what messages do you have for Cancer Celtic Cross for February 2022? Right away, we got the Eight of Wands coming in. You could be traveling or delivering a message to somebody, Cancer. Going towards somebody. There's some type of news that you want to share, possibly. What is the challenge for February 2022 for Cancer? All right, the Six of Cups is the challenge. Okay, so you could be dealing with a sibling. You could be dealing with somebody from your past. Ace of Cups. This is somebody that you could possibly love very, very much that you're dealing with here that's creating some type of challenge for you. There's something that you want to tell this person. Okay, I'm taking these all back. We got the Four of Swords and Judgment. Okay. I feel like there's something that somebody wants to bring to somebody's attention that they don't know about. Somebody could have been sleeping on a situation. You could be wanting to bring this to this person's awareness here. The higher font. Okay, somebody's trying to do the right thing here. That's what I'm seeing. Show me the recent past for cancer. Oh my goodness. We have the chariot and then we have the empress in reverse. Okay, so this could be somebody's mother. Ugh. Okay, this could be somebody's mother who is not being very loving or empathetic at this time. Nurturing. Uh, Whoever this person is that's in these lower vibrations, they are not able to manifest anything right now or bring forth anything. Three of Pentacles, yeah. <laughs> it ain't working out. But they want a victory, but they're not in the right energy to do so. King of Wands. Show me the overall energy. <clears throat> we got the Three of Wands. We got the three of wands. So you could have been traveling towards this person. This person could have been on your path or as a part of your path or a part of your journey in some way. You're waiting on something. Maybe you're waiting to deliver this news or to contact somebody. Show me the near future for cancer. I'm really kind of wanting to know what this information is that you have. We got the Ten of Wands. Oh. I feel like in the near future, you're going to be tired of carrying some type of burden. I feel like this might not even be your burden to carry. Oh my God, the Two of Cups in reverse. It's in reverse. There's some type of contract that's been broken here. A soul contract. Somebody's out. Somebody, or it ended. This is like the two, I already changed it, damn it. And <laughs> now we got the Queen of Swords here. Yeah, but the Two of Cups in reverse is just like, the, that's usually like a soul tie or a soul contract. I feel like somebody's soul contract is up, possibly. So you and somebody else's business is done in this lifetime. The karmic debt has been paid. Oh my God, show me what Cancer is showing up as. What are they viewing themselves as, Spirit? 
Ooh, I went through this deck. <laughs> like, what the fuck was happening? Okay, Knight of Wands. So you're looking at trying to hurry up and move. I feel like you're trying to approach somebody here, Cancer. With the High Priest, is there something that you know? There's some type of information that you're trying to deliver to somebody, a message that you're trying to get through. I don't know why I'm feeling like it's urgent here, but that's how it's coming across. Because we have the Eight of Wands, which is fast moving information messages or somebody just moving quickly. It's a lot of Wands energies here. I'm definitely feeling like somebody's dealing with a family member, a close relative, a sibling, um, or somebody that they've known for a long time. Could even be a good best friend. We got the Queen of Wands here. So in the environment... Ooh, somebody's looking really good in your environment. King of Wands and Queen of Wands. This person could be a divine counterpart. Not to you. I'm not feeling like this person is a divine counterpart to you. But you could be looking at this person or admiring this person. Or this person has a lot of admirers. This could be also how somebody's seeing you. Okay. Show me the hopes and fears. Thank you. Oh my god. I was about to say 888, but it's not. Let's see. No. Okay, so we got the Eight of Swords here. Somebody's fear is, oh god. Being stuck or trapped in a situation that they can't get out of. The stars in reverse. Somebody's and then the Wheel of Fortune. The Wheel of Fortune is turning in somebody's favor. Somebody's afraid that that could be not good news for them. So they're trying to say, you're trying to say something or get a message to somebody before. I don't know, before you become stuck or trapped in a situation. I'm feeling like somebody's trying to prevent something here for themselves. Like, I don't know what this is. It's like you don't want to be the one left holding the ball, some shit like that. King of Wands again. King and Queen of Wands. Uh, show me the potential outcome. Potential outcome for Cancer in the month of February. Eight of Cups, so there is 888. Man, did I call it or did I call it? 888, so that could be significance to you. This could be about finances. Eights are about abundance, infinite abilities, infinite possibilities, money, the inner twining of energies here, Give the equal exchange of energies here. Three of Pentacles. So in the outcome, somebody's walking away. All right, let's clarify these because I'm nosy and I need to see what's going on. What is this Eight of Wands for Cancer, Spirit? Eight of Wands for Cancer. We got the Four of Pentacles. So you could be delivering a message to somebody about um, somebody holding on or holding back some money. Ace of Wands at the bottom of the deck. Ten of Cups in reverse. Yeah, this is some type of family situation. Some family quarrel I'm getting. Show me the Six of Cups as the challenge. The High Priestess. Oh, she. Yeah. This person, uh, <laughs> this person already knows. They know something. They are this person could be highly intuitive. Uh very intuitive. They know some shit is going on. Like intuitive their soul probably knows. We got the seven of swords at the bottom of the deck. This is somebody trying to get away with something. Somebody being sneaky, deceptive, strategizing, planning. This could be three people here. Siblings, three of cups. Okay. Three people. Plotting and planning. All right. Oh my God. What else do we have here? We got another four. 
And then we got the Seven of Cups in reverse. So the illusion has been lifted. Somebody is seeing something here. Okay, yeah, there's been divine intervention here. We got the Hierophant with the Seven of Cups in reverse. And then we have the Four of Cups. Like, <laughs> ooh. Uh, yeah, this was divine intervention. Somebody that, some, something is about to be completed. That's what I'm getting here. Ace of Swords, that's the truth. <laughs> that is the truth. The truth has been spoken. All right, show me this Three of Wands. Cancer, why y'all always got some shit going on? Why? Oh my God, all the cards and all of them. Okay, so here we got the Knave of Wands. There's definitely was something that somebody regrets doing. I feel like they didn't play the hugest role in this situation, but they did play a role in this. And now they're coming to straighten something out. We got the emperor here. Then I see the empress. Yeah, the empress is over here in reverse. Oh my God, justice. Somebody's about to get justice. I feel like, Cancer, you're taking control over a situation that you could have been involved in. Five of cups. Somebody has regret. That's what I was saying. Okay, show me the Ten of Wands in the near future for Cancer. Seven of Pentacles. All right. We got the Strength in Reverse at the bottom of the deck. Okay, so what, there, oof. Maybe, oh, okay. Somebody don't want me to talk about this. Okay. Strength card again, all the way over there in reverse still, though. All right, so you might have been holding on to this uh, secret for a while. Whatever this is that you're trying to come forth and say or do. Now, this has been going on for a while. I think that you're tired of it. And it's like it's time to put it down now. It's not your problem no more. Maybe you feel like it's unjust. Show me this Knight of Wands. Okay. Ooh. All right. So some of you guys want your happiness. Somebody wants their happily ever after. Somebody wants their wish fulfilled. Somebody's trying to make up for what they've done here. That's what I'm getting. Somebody could be trying to make up to you, Cancer, for what they've done to you. Or this could be you trying to make up for what you've done or kept from somebody else. Show me the Queen of Wands. Oh, my goodness. We have the Queen of Cups in reverse. And the Three of Pentacles. Okay, so there was somebody who definitely was not using their emotions appropriately here. Somebody was taken advantage of. Again, I'm getting three, three multiple people. Hmm. Six of Pentacles and Ten of Cups. This person is about to get reciprocity here. Whoever this is in your environment. They're coming out of hiding. They've done some work on themselves, some shadow work. Hmm. The strength card keeps flipping over in reverse. Okay, so somebody's not holding back no more. Somebody's not holding back anymore. All right, show me this Eight of Swords and the fear. Hopes or fears. We got the Ace of Cups. I'm getting right here that somebody's worried that somebody's not going to forgive them for what they've done here. King of Pentacles. Show me the Eight of Cups. I don't know why I'm getting this feeling that somebody thinks someone's gone for good. Knight of Pentacles. It took this person a long time to walk away. There's there's some type of jealousy was playing out here. Five of Pentacles. What am I telling you? 
somebody could have been jealous and wanted to leave somebody out of something or abandon somebody. All right. Yeah. All right, Cancer. Let's. I'm gonna go ahead and pause this and clear this out the way so we can get into your love spread. All right, Cancer. We're back. Let's go ahead and get into your love messages. I'm going to put your energy on the left, your person's energy on the right. Spirit guides, benevolent ancestors, give me four cards for Cancer's energy and love. Cancer's energy and love, Spirit. Oh my God, I knew it. Eight of Wands. Okay. So yes, Eight of Wands again. The High Priestess again. Okay, so you know something has to be done here. You know there's a move you have to make. There's some type of information that you have to say. Oh, the Wheel of Fortune. Oh my God. All right, one, one more. King of Swords. All right. Let's see what your person has. Something's about to change. Oh my God. Somebody's coming in for the long haul. Somebody wants it all with you, Cancer. The house, the car, the kids, and the dog. What else? What else about this person? Uh. <laughs> all right, all right. What else? Ace of Pentacles in reverse. This person could have missed the opportunity with you. I feel like they're working on something, trying to bring it back. Three of, <laughs> three of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Yeah, somebody's trying to come back into union here. Hmm. I'm feeling like though somebody's not watching you anymore. Or they're not trying to figure something out anymore, but they're also not making any moves. I'm seeing that they want the Ten of Pentacles, but maybe they already feel like they missed this opportunity. So, mm, we got the Ace of Wands at the bottom of the deck. Let me clarify. I know there's a lot of background noise, y'all. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. All right, show me the Ten of Pentacles. Ten of Swords, ten ten. So yeah, this could definitely be somebody wanting to try again here. We man, this is the time for people to be coming back in Mercury retrograde. I'm feeling like this person's not taking much 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 action right now though. Like I'm just feeling like they're not. Show me this Ace of Pentacles. Why is it in reverse? Five of uh, wands, yeah. This person doesn't know how to come in and approach you. Yeah, they're feeling stuck and trapped in their mind. Maybe they're trying to figure out a plan or a strategy. Maybe they feel like they fucked it up last time, so now they got a plan. They could be having some hesitation, some internal conflict, whether or not to come towards you again. Six of Pentacles. I'm seeing here, though, that they want to give equally here. They could just have some work to do on themselves here. They're trying to balance something out. Maybe they're trying to get their finances in order. I don't know. But they're trying to get something right before they come back to the situation because, obviously, something didn't work before. All right, Cancer, let's move on to your career, finances, and money. Just one second. All right, Cancer, let's get your final messages for career, finances, and or money coming in for you for February 2022. Spirit, guys, what messages? Something already flipped. What was it? Two of Swords in reverse. Okay. 
What else, spirit? Four of Cups. Two of Swords in reverse, Four of Cups. All right, so, oh. Yeah, I don't know what this deck just did, but <laughs> uh, we got the Six of Pentacles again. So something's going to be balancing out for you. Okay, I was trying to let that train pass by because it's loud as perk, but let's keep going. What else? Let me get two more. Like, for real, y'all got to blow that horn that loud. It is not that serious. Okay, we got the four of wands. This four of wands keep coming out. They keep coming out. And everybody's read. Three of cups. Oh, okay. So again, there, there's somebody that you're working with or somebody that... I don't know. Ten of Wands in reverse. <laughs> There's something that you definitely weren't satisfied in. You want reciprocity for something. Maybe you feel like you made the wrong choice here. And now you want to make things right. This is somebody who wasn't doing anything before, but now wants to make take action here. You could have been dormant or resting in the situation, and now it's like you know you need to take action towards something. What else, Spirit? Show me what I need to see for cancer, money, career, finance. We got the Eight of Pentacles. Another eight. Eight. And then 44 might be significant too. I've seen fours come out in your um, Celtic cross spread too. There's definitely something that was building up. Somebody could be saving up a lot of money. I'm getting here too that somebody watched somebody work a lot. The Wheel of Fortune. Something's about to change though. There, this Some type of situation is about to turn around. Somebody's discovering some type of lie. Oh, we. The sun in reverse and then the ace of swords. Okay. I'm feeling like there's like a whole list of something that somebody's been lying about. Like somebody's whole life was a lie. Show me the, what the fuck is happening here. Nine of wands. Uh, this was not supposed to come out not even slowly like this was never supposed to be spoken of what is going on here this ain't even about money is it the ace of cups i feel like there's some other energy that's like pushing in here i mean maybe underlying this could have something to do with finances but i'm feeling like there's something else happening here The star in reverse. Somebody definitely... Oh, and that's the Ten of Pentacles that just dropped. Watch. Oh, my God. Ten of Pentacles on the floor. What did I just see, though? The star in reverse. Somebody... Yeah, it do have to do with money. It, it does have to do with money. There... Somebody that was wounded... In the past here is about to be something's about to turn around for them. What else? I don't know if you're assisting in this cancer. I feel like you are. I feel like you want something to good to come of this. There's some type there's a house involved or a business or something. There's some money coming in for somebody. Queen of Wands. You have love for this person. This could be a family member. We got the Ace of Wands and the Fool. Yeah, something about to change here for somebody. The Magician. 
and then the ten of swords somebody couldn't stop something this path was supposed to be stopped it didn't get stopped king of pentacles was behind that somebody's stability there was something jealous something about jealousy going on here but somebody doesn't want to regret this anymore yeah, I'm definitely getting a heavy sense of regret here. Somebody's trying to make amends. But I'm going to go ahead and leave it right there for you, Cancer. I really appreciate you guys for watching. Make sure you hit that like button on your way out. Comment down below. And if you vibe, make sure you subscribe. I will see you next time.